I don't know. We we tend to get kind of uh, every set review takes longer than you think. Right, because I can't shut up. Yeah, we 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 just can't. So um, I got like a million messages for exited host mode, so I presume that's going. Yes, and I I see the the glass. Ah, very good. Okay, so um, as you all know, because you're you know part of the community, you speak the L like those of us who are in the inn. <laughs> so, um, a as you know, they, a new set came out. Um, so we're going to review it. I finally yep, convinced finally convinced Medibot to do a set review, although uh, it's not magic cards this time. So uh, we're going to, we're just going to launch right into it. I... So why don't you, uh, why don't you start us off? All right, so we're going to start off with the comments. We're going to go up through, mm -hmm. uh, up through Rarity. Uh, so first off, we have a beer mug uh, clocking in at uh, 500 milliliters. So a good sort of mid-size. Yeah, yeah, I mean, got... decent um, decent mid-rangey common, you know, no frills, really. You know, the, the, ha the handle makes it, makes it a pretty safe pick. Yeah, yeah, totally safe. Uh, it's got toughness out of the wazoo. Right? Oh my like, god, like... This is ultra tough. You can like, pretty much only break this on purpose. Right. And even then, 50-50. Mm. Yeah, I mean, you're you're more likely to, to hurt, you, hurt yourself or, or your companions if you try. So, um, can't ask for more than that. Uh, super safe pick, I would say, in, in limited. Um... Decent in constructed too. Yeah, it's really it's, like it's decent in constructed if you're just after its sort of sort of toughness. Um, but yeah, it's not going to do anything super. It's has some has some kind of uh, a little more in the in the way of upkeep than I, I expect for most commons. Yeah. So there is there is that. But if you're just trying yeah. to get to bigger vessels, mm. this is a good yeah. step. On the way right, there. right, right. This is like your your mid sized plus kind of tough, uh, tough choice. And that is not to say that the choice is tough because given the option, you know, it's probably going to be a straightforward pick. Um, but I I think more often than not, it will it will be just you know this is the best available option. Just go with beer bug and. Yeah, yeah. In, li in limited, it's like that. nothing sticks out. You pick the deal bug. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty, pretty, uh, pretty simple. So we, yeah, I'm, I'm happy to see these out of the set. Frankly, um, the set has a lot of these. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. You know, uh, it's, it's important. Some, some basic designs. You know, not trying to do too much, especially it's, with it's the commons. That you, your commons are very easy to understand because that's what your, right. your players are going to be They've seeing. got to be role players and nothing is a better limited role player than, than Beer Mug here. So, All right. Uh, any any closing thoughts on this one? Uh, no. Like uh, the illustration even? Uh, I mean, again, the, the illustration I think, you know, it's it's good. Clearly the artist is competent. It's mm. Again, the the common needs to be pretty easy for new yeah, players. Yeah, like it it is. It's it's perfectly evocative and doesn't. I mean, it doesn't it doesn't amaze me. You know, and I'm not, I'm not blown away by any stretch. Um, occasionally, you can find. Uh, I, I guess I should mention this. You can find promos, uh, promo versions of this, um, and it'll be like I I don't have the the promo in front of me, of course, but there's all all kinds of different promos that they have just. Um, modified illustration yeah, uh, yeah, people also want, do custom, uh, a lot of custom mods yeah, of, of this love one customizing their they just modes. yeah but they'll just paint right over it um, full art is is pretty common for that so you'll you'll see full art mods of the uh, of beer mug floating around all right, right. yeah okay so who's next all right so next up is gonna be a uh, champagne flute. Champagne uh, flute, I think I have coming that one. In okay. At two hundred twenty two milliliters. Alright. So this uh, one also common. Still yes, in common? Yeah, also I mean well, they, they have to have more than one common. Okay. Yeah. 
Oh, hell, champagne flute. Mm-hmm. So, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna just open up by saying I'm a little biased because I really like to, I guess, be in the kind of situation where champagne flute is good. Okay, yeah. Because no, I, I there's that. nothing I love more than just like, but by, by by like you know. We're just a couple minutes into the game. I'm just mimosa, 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 and it's just like <laughs> just no. Very... Okay, so you like you're you're a big fan of the aggro strategy. Yes, yeah. I I just I like. Well, I mean, is... you can't really ask for for better than um than this for for aggro for like baseline aggro. There, are, we'll we'll get to some more aggressive, um, uh, even more like low to the ground options. Yeah. Um, later in the in the set, they definitely you know they they have some of those sort of the uh, the chase uncommons and chase rares that yeah, yeah. Uh, are <laughs> used for chasers as it turns out, funnily enough. But um, yeah, I mean someone someone drew the comparison to um, a piker, like if yeah. you're playing a different game um, with the with beer mug, and I think that's that's way incorrect. This this is your piker. You know, like that's you know, you just, good for the aggro. You just to Almost no toughness. Understand you. See, that's that's the other thing you got to be aware of. Like, <laughs> practically no toughness to these things. Oh, absolutely. Uh, especially these, if these things you cough on them wrong. They're right. Gone. Now, the the funny part is you um, you'll sometimes find fake versions of this. This is a popular uh, a popular unit to proxy. Which is weird because it's a common. I know, I know. It's, but I, I don't, I don't understand the rationale. But it's, um, you, you can tell the difference between a proxy right away. You don't have to destroy it like in other, uh, with other systems. You don't have to destroy the thing to do this test. Uh, just check out the the seam. Actually, my cursor's on screen, so I can highlight this. Um, right where the stem joins the 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 cup. If it's fused. You, you'll be able to see, like, a, a line between that. And that's a proxy. So, the, more the, the pity. genuine like, article is going to be one... Uh, yeah, one it's one piece. contiguous piece. Um, of course, I, I defer to Medibot for uh, all of my my glazier, glaziistic no, knowledge. The, he works with much glass, more glass than... Glass. Well, it, even still... Like, I mean, you have your foot in the door of understanding that glass. So it, all I'm saying is, if you want to know how the sausage get, gets made and the sausage... <laughs> Sorry, let me let me start that again. I've had, I've had a little much water tonight. Yes. Got too much of the water in my system. <laughs> Sloshing Hold around. On. Hold on, I need, I'm going to take a, another little sip. Hmm. Okay, so what I was trying to say was... Uh, if you want to know how the sausage gets made, and that sausage is made of glass, you should ask Medibot. But yeah, um, this it's it's very fragile, but mm. you can play it very aggressively, yeah. way earlier than a lot of other vessels. Yeah, upkeep like cost said, is actually pretty low too, and that's yeah. uh, that's good. I mean, if you have if you have a if you have the smaller vessels, you got you're gonna want a low upkeep cost. To match them, like there's nothing worse than an aggro plan that has high upkeep. Because then, yeah, no, <laughs> like that your your whole your whole strategy is going to collapse. You just, you just lose you're, steam too fast. Yeah, you're you're, you're asking to have like no reach at all. You know, you have no late game if that's if that's really what you're up to. But this this allows you to still have late game. So that's um that one's pretty good. I guess it's worth it's worth mentioning that in most circumstances, the uh, the orifice of the flute is small enough that it covers your nose. So if you if you don't want to get anything in your nose, you can kind of form a small seal, and that's mm. uh, that's beneficial for uh, keeping bubbles out of your nose. Mm. Which will which will happen with other dudes. Right. So if you this is this it, is something be, that yeah it could be a unit mismatch if um you know if you suit it up with something where you know that's not really an issue maybe 
maybe you know you should be putting those pants on a larger unit really it doesn't really wear those well but uh there there are lots of again good aggressive options um that are bubbly and that's what you would want this for it keeps it keep it out of your nose then again if it's your la if it's the last one you need like absolutely just throw caution to the wind oh sure. do sure. do what it takes to win <laughs> yeah like <laughs> i mean i guess that goes without saying i mean there's um Magic has the Lava Axe, Eternal has the, um, whatever Eternal's version of the Lava Axe is that no one plays, Detonate, I think. Codemaster Conflict has the Sword Bomb. So <laughs> I feel like the game we're talking about is the Sword Bomb. <laughs> but no, but this one has the boot, and if you really need a boot, then you can have it. All right. I think that's about all for okay. the champagne yeah, that's, flute. Yeah, we've, we've spent way too many words on champagne flute. So we're moving on. All right, so next up is uh, the Vox Glass. Another common coming in at mm -hmm. 290 milliliters. Okay. So it's still pretty low to the ground. Yeah, right, right. right. Yeah. A, a lot less fragile. Uh, yeah, than the like this is, this is sort of a weird place for, for units, if I'm being honest, because... It's uh, it's clearly like sized for more of an aggressive strategy, but tough enough for closer to mid range or, um, or even control strategies. And to yeah, be honest, it, it can kind of go a lot of different directions. Yeah, no, I mean, uh, you'll you'll see it most commonly in the control game, right? Like you want to go long, you want to really nurse this, and uh, and the toughness comes into play there. So. Uh, I mean, all all control decks kind of need something like this, right? The uh, the early early defender. So aggressive decks have the like early to late aggressor. Um, control decks have the control finisher, but control also has the the early defender to get in the way of uh, of aggro strategies. So it's not gonna like it's not gonna put up the most offense, but it is going to uh, it's gonna block very well. But also, as I as I mentioned, uh, the Rocks Glass can there are a lot of different directions you can go with Rocks Glass. That's true. Um, I'm only talking so about the uh, the control like having the control one game. or two of them. When I'm when I'm just going like all in champagne flutes, I mm. usually like having one or two just to support, just so like I don't get completely hosed by by something that shatters all my flutes. Right. Um. And I think um, once again we have like th this is just as good in limited as it is in constructed. Yeah. Like you can this... you can always it's a limited role player you can always pick one of these up. Um, constructed still a solid choice. You know right. they're, you're, they're... you're going to be a little a little pickier about what goes into it in constructed. Oh course. sure. Um, but most decks have something decent they can put in a box class. Mm, absolutely. Right. No, I, uh, um, yeah, nothing to, to write home about about the illustration again. Um, yep. Hmm. Yeah, I think we've covered all our bases. Moving on. All right, moving on. Uh, next, uh, next common is going to be the shot glass. Oh, the uh, shot glass. Uh, <laughs> Show not to scale. Meetings. I'm sorry about this. Uh, I don't. <laughs> I don't. These are these are early spoilers, so we don't have like the actual set art. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, so not this is not a uh, uh, trust the number, which was again fifty nine. Fifty nine milliliters. Holy crap! Okay. So just for reference, like I'm, I'm looking down the list. Oh I'm, no, I'm dog! Half the size as the next smallest. Hmm. BB. We hear you. We hear you. I'm sorry about this, you guys. Sorry about this, you guys. Uh, BB also wants in on the on the set review, but you uh -huh. can't. Not even for shot glass. Shot no, glass is not for dog. For dog. Mm -mm. It's no good. But BB, yeah, BB is uh, not in the game. That's not real. Uh, okay, so that out of the way. Illustration not to scale. Pay attention to the number. Uh, Fifty nine is as low as you're gonna get. Right. Yes. Like there is no there is no 
more like aggro bent thing than this. It has absolutely no place in control. Um, you're just trying to <laughs> get about put as many of these on the table as possible. Essentially, like, you're, you're just. <laughs> You 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 grab an armful, throw them at your opponent, and hope that your problems are all solved. Because if mm. not, you got nothing left. You have you have right. a dang floor. Yeah, and you know, it, as far as that goes, it's ideal. You know, this is this is simple, no frills, uh, very low upkeep. You right. can clean and, it right and away. Like, there, like there's always there's always one person at every like super high stakes event. One person who's just like yo. I, I'm just I'm just rolling shot glasses today. Oh god damn it! Yep. <laughs> right, and it's like maybe shot glass guy just gets to steal a win off you today. You know, you slip yeah. up a little bit, and shot glass is just over the shot, shot. Yeah, shot, no, I mean like, it's, oh, it's sort no, of it's the happening. it's sort of the boogeyman. Right, like in in a weird way, it ke- it almost keeps things honest because it's like if That's you true. always lose to the shot glass. Then it's right. Like, I mean, it has it has the best goldfish no game of yeah. uh, anything, except one vessel that we'll get to later. So uh, I think remind me that I said uh, goldfish because okay. this is this is the second best for that. There is there is a better specifically for for goldfish. Um, but yeah. Oh, another thing is that uh, because this is a common and so readily available, um, I guess uh, again I should say it's. Like, this happens in limited. This is not, I mean, not as as frequently found in in, uh, in your constructed environments there, but right. um, you, in in it's constructed, still... it's usually like if just at the time the environment is leaning very aggressively, people will start or like e- either it's like people start getting way too aggro and start including shot glasses, or it gets way too control and people try to sneak under with shot oh, glasses. Oh, absolutely. And this is this is the best way to do it. But the other thing about this um, being so like readily available is you'll see people with near unlimited personalization to these. <laughs> it's oh, like, yeah. <laughs> oh my so god, there's so mode, many... Like, yeah, most... like... There's just, there's so many premium versions of this. And so it's like, it's so dirt cheap that people try to like prop it up and, and um, you know, on the secondary market by uh, doing all kinds of detailing and... Um... They'll make a set that has a theme. Oh man. Yeah, and they'll all have like... like, it'll be like two guys high-fiving each other and then you move the, the glasses next to one another and... Anyway, that's... I um... never play these, by the way. Like, if you ever catch me <laughs> playing this, it means that it's like, I have already lost. Oh, man, that's... I'll keep that in mind. Oh, like, I'll keep that in mind. Like, all of my really bad tournament losses in the past... And you've seen some of my bad tournament losses, but it's been mm. worse, and those have involved shot. But... Whew. Well, um, fair... <laughs> Just, I guess, if you're... If this is your style, then... Um, can't do better than this. If it's not your style, then absolutely prepare to face this matchup. Yes. Okay, moving on. Next up is the just your uh, straight up pint glass. Mm. I'm rolling that. That's that's what I'm maining and constructed right now, actually. Five sixty eight milliliters, so a little bit, uh, a little bit tougher than the uh, than the beer mug. Right. Um. Yeah, it's a it's a bigger unit. For sure. Um, not as... It, it doesn't have the durability, right? Right, so. right. It's, it doesn't have the, the quite the staying power. But it can do a little... Uh, just a little bit more for you than a beer mug. Can. Right. And so it's, um, it's so really... It's, 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 it's a tempo strategy, right? If you can just be, like, reliably... New pints... Yeah, if you, if you can re- reliably do this, you can you can win most any match. Yeah. Right. Uh, I mean, people can go under you. Um, you're probably not going to be consistent enough at this to beat a, a solid control build, but you know, this is a is a no frills unit. Uh, lower toughness than beer mug. Uh, lower upkeep cost too. Yeah. You know, this is like I mean, this is about as as cheap an upkeep cost as you can get <laughs> on any of these. 
Yeah. So if it has any superlative features, that's that's it. Um, I'm not a big fan of the illustration, to be honest. It, right. The, the illustration on this is honestly a little weak, which is mm. why, again, um, you know, all of the all of the pint glasses I I own, I've gotten. I've gotten modified. Oh just, yeah, I don't want to just look. I mean, they way. they take really well to uh, to alters. Yeah, but... yeah. I have my uh, my my Kirby alter. Right uh, Kirby alter is really good, but I mean, that's that sort of represents the problem with the illustration that I have, which right, is, is that no like, one wants to play an, alt- an alter. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I, I get they they want their uh, their rarer vessels to be like more uh, more splashy, more evocative, but illustration doesn't necessarily also need to be that same thing like you can have you can have a boring unit that has just fantastic illustration and that doesn't sure. detract from the function of the of the unit in the set or or in the game so yeah i don't know right can they update the art <laughs> i feel like <laughs> oh man blood fashion is right on point uh, they they just keep rehashing the same they, they, illustration. I just <laughs> have they printed a single set without this? Oh, that's uh, I'll have to I'll have to search. For, I think so. I think so. Um, it was but a everyone weird. Everyone was really freaked out when they did. It was a weird year. Yeah, yeah. Uh, not not much more to say about pint glass. It's, uh, I, again, I I like it. I, I don't want any of this to, to as to say that I'm too good to play it. Or anything like, like oh, that. Yeah, that's the other. No, absolutely not. Like, <laughs> you're no not too good to on play the this. Planet is too good <laughs> for a pint glass. No one hmm. too good. Okay. Like, like, yeah. Okay. What do we? What do we have? All right. Um, finishing out our commons. Ooh. Okay. Uh, coming in at a uh, 215 milliliters, we have the wine. Glass. Wine glass. Okay. Yeah. Um, I guess similar. Similar evaluation to Champagne Flute. Um, yep. Again, this is another one of the like readily proxied ones that has the same uh, fusion at the stem sometimes that you see, and that's like, you know, you just have to avoid that. Certainly in limited, like don't let anyone pass you a, <laughs> don't let anyone pass you a fake and and make you accept it. It's like, come on, they're supposed to they're supposed to have better than that. Um, I mean, you know, if it's just kitchen table stuff, then I'm not going to stop you from playing proxies. Sure, just, if, if, you're just, it... if you've just got a cube among friends, then, yeah. then sure, whatever, whatever. Oh, no, works. this is, like, proxies of this are perfect for cube. Yeah. Absolutely perfect. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm not above that. But, you know, you got to, for for more formal events, you got to you gotta step up your game. Also, um, don't be as... fooled by the... So, like, this this is a thing that trips up a lot of new players who don't, you know, read the glass correctly. Uh, this has a does have a slightly lower capacity than the champagne flute. Yeah, it is sneaky. Like, it's it's a difficult, um, it's a difficult comparison to make if you're just looking at the two side by side. But just yeah. like keep to the keep to the rules text, right? Right. Like that's you what's gonna save steps. you. Like you're, you're, it's easy to get lost in the, um, it's easy to get lost in in things like the illustration or like how you're feeling about stuff or like you you might have a good memory of like using one or the other before and use that to kind of influence your judgment. Just you know read the text, stick with that. <laughs> it'll uh, it'll do you better than you than you even realize. I think that's that's the best advice. I can give to newer players, right? It's just like listen to the card first, or the the. I'm sorry, the back in the, damn it, back in the magic lingo. There are no cards. Uh, listen to the vessel first, and um, and pay attention to the text, and then you can take recommendations from from like people or your your teammates or whatever. I don't. I don't use this one too often. I guess you have more experience with this one than I do. Uh, I do. Um, this is the the like other side of the coin. Uh, with the wider mouth allows you to cover your nose, so it's not ide- It doesn't wear. Uh, it doesn't wear bubbly drinks very well, because um, you'll just end up like splashing up your nose basically, and that's yeah. no good. 
It's intense. Um, but for for most other like uh, for most other pants, for most anything else you want to suit this up with, uh, this is nice still beverages. Um, that's that's where you want to be. Yeah, and, and like even though this is a common, like keep in mind you can put you can put some impressive stuff in here, mm, mm -hmm. like absolutely. Oh, All right, time to move on to the uncommons. Move on to the right? uncommons. All right, coming in at exciting. Three hundred forty-four milliliters. We have the chalice. The chalice. The chalice. Hot diggy. Well, I mean, this is this is what we expect from the shift from uh, commons to uncommons. I think we, we, we gotta, you don't you don't necessarily oh see more power level, although I think this is more powerful. Well, um, you you compare the stem on this to the stem on the wine glass we were just looking at, right? <laughs> and it's like <laughs> there's a difference here. Yeah, no smoke. Uh, like similarly, you. For that same reason, I should say you you never see proxies of this. No. <laughs> like no one wants to, no one dares. No, if you got <laughs> caught with a proxy chalice, they wouldn't have to ban you because you would want to evaporate. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but anyway, uh, again, like I was saying, um, this is the kind of transition you see going from commons to uncommons. Not necessarily an upgrade in power level straight um i think this is more powerful than a lot of the the comments that we were looking at but mm. it's uh, it's definitely a step up in complexity yes so it's uh, a deeper there's, there's design a going on and if 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 that's your your thing if you just like to appreciate the design of vessels then you could do way worse than saying okay yeah this is my uh this is my thing But yeah, the chalice. You also get to pretend that you're uh, King Arthur or whatever, and it's like, ah, oh, yep. the chalice. It's got a, it's got a rich. Um, they they draw upon a, a rich and There's storied background, like real world background when when they designed this. A lot of lore. I don't think it's gonna get banned. No, no, no one's gonna ban the chalice. Why would they ban chalice? It's not. A cornerstone like, of any broken thing. Well, okay, that's that's funny. There is a there's a a a card called Chalice in a different card game. That is that has no similarity to this other than the name. So don't don't worry about that. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I just realized that. Yeah. Uh, anyway, pretty solid. Pretty solid. All right. Uh, next up, we sort of have a a, a similar. Similar vessel coming mm -hmm. in at 268 milliliters, the Goblet. The Goblet. Now, I'm delighted to see this. Because this is the this is the foot in the door of Goblet Tribal. Right. So, I like, mean, you, you can't avoid it. They get everywhere. Goblet Tribal. I, like, <laughs> I can't deal with all these guys. <laughs> You know, it starts with a goblet, and then you get to goblet, 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 and it just multiplies out. You're done. So I mean, okay, we don't we don't have the full support for that just yet, but let me let me tell you, this signifies that it is absolutely coming. It's if you if you see the first goblet you see in construct, and it's like okay, they're on goblets. Yep, my opponent's on goblets. They are absolutely it's, on goblets. It's also always a little scary in limited because it's like all right do they just like basic because it's like because it's an uncommon you don't know if anyone at the table got enough goblets to make goblets happen or if this yeah, is just like oh, it, it might be the you know the the, the speculative goblets. they just really like goblets from like, reading childhood like, stories or, or whatever but i have i have been in terrifying limited games where there's there's just you know there's someone there and they they just decided in their heart like all right if i if i get the pick one goblet i'm on goblets tonight mm. and they get it yep. and they just completely lean into it and they they run the rest of the shop no one no one can because just enough goblets were opened and other people you know they're like mm, you know not really feeling goblets i don't think i can make goblets work tonight but the one exactly one person believed in it, 
and they destroy. If two people believe in it, they destroy each other. Yeah, not enough goblets. Yeah, I've I've seen that happen before, but... and that's always tragic, but a little fun. Yeah, so I think this is. I, I'm gonna put this down as my uh, favorite uncommon. Mm. I have a I have a favorite uh, card. Or, sorry, God, card vessel from the set that will uh, that I'll try to point out later. It's my pick. Um, wait, let me uncommons. make sure that. Let me make sure that that's accurate. Um, I have notes. And we can we can move on to the next one. I'll figure out what my. I, oh, I know next I up at. Uh, oh, yep. Okay, I got it. Never mind. At seven hundred, which is the largest we've gotten so far. We oh have man. The glass. Okay, now, this this one gets my goat. All right, I tell me say. tell me how your goat. Has I'm gotten not I'm this. not happy to see margarita glass in the set. Uh, I think they can do way better than this. This is. I'm gonna be honest. Even as someone who likes margaritas, I don't want to see this either. I'm not surprised. The entire the entire construction of of the drink is one that annihilates sensation. It's it's enough sugar and salt, alcohol, uh, acid to just bombard your your taste buds so that to blast you into submission and then you're not tasting anything after right, that. You're just getting flavor blasted. I'm getting I'm getting some dirty looks from my wife. <laughs> no, but like I think about every time. Get, not like only I'm that, drafted. but they serve it cold enough to freeze your face off. So you're you're compl- If you weren't numb from the acid, you're numb from the cold. And then it's so large that it consumes your entire face and head. I just, I I can't. There's there's no way that I'm going to be able to build a like a limited or constructed. Forget about it. There's no way I'm going to be able to build up to something this large and, and right. get away with like, it. There, there's, like, I, I never... They, they call it the margarita glass, but if I want to run margaritas, I'm doing it out of pint glasses. And it works better. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So Burnhead is saying I've just, you know, I, I didn't get a, a good build. Okay. Oh, that's that's a bad build. Uh, yeah, okay, I, I guess. <sighs> that's, I, just, I, I can't even believe it. Science so even couldn't couldn't we just make a smaller? Could we, do we have to go this huge? <laughs> the half, you want the half margarita? <laughs> it, oh, okay, no, okay, you're right. Really no, you're you're right. You're right. I guess it's better in casuals. I just ah, I can't. <laughs> it's good in uh, two-headed giant. Ooh, that. oh, that's true. When you now, if you if you talk about two, two HG and and team, yeah, no, that's then then, then it actually starts like, to make okay, sense, right? right yeah, class mm-hmm. or something you want to because do you can that. get that big. Like it's a it's a slower format. You yeah. know, there's there's more team action. No, that's that suddenly makes sense. Okay, no, you turned out. I I appreciate. Uh, I think I, I have a, a better appreciation for for why they put this in the set. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go back, gonna revise it's my opinion. HG okay, plan. I I totally understand. I was not I did not remember two HG. So um, yeah, so I I think it goes there. Um, I really don't want to see it outside. <laughs> I'm not. I'm gonna. I, I'm not. I'm gonna try not to judge people. If I see this in limited, I'm, if you see someone rocking I this, mean, I'm not gonna judge. Sometimes you 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 go drinking with the vessel you have. Sometimes. Okay, okay. That, that's true. That's true. This is as, as primarily a limited player. I keep that in my heart. That like mm. I say like ah, you know I like this. I don't like this. But ultimately. I am not too good for anything on this list if it really comes down to it. Yeah. All right. That's Margarita Glass. That is that Margarita Glass. I'm not going to see something quite that big. That That is uh, the largest of the commons and uncommon. Okay. You do not get anything bigger until rare. That doesn't surprise um, me. So uh, uh, next let's up, move on. At a much more modest 130 milliliters, we have the Martini Glass. Now this, 
It's good, but it's overrated. If that this is sense. this is hugely overrated. This is like, easily the most overrated vessel in the set, probably in any set. I have no love. Yeah, I have I mean, no love for this like, at all. I I'm I can't really dig up a fast counter argument to that. There are too many players who just get taught about the power of martini glass and never stop to evaluate it or evaluate anything else. And they just play Martini Glass until the end of time. And I love getting free like, rings off of them. Uh, okay, so... It's it's sized for an aggressive strategy, but in every other way fits a, a mid-range or, or control build. Um, the kinds of pants that it wears just don't fit. Um, I can't. Wait, I just. I can't say enough bad things that, about that. You're like, probably. You're... Like, it can work. It's not a an aggressively bad vessel. It's just that it gets played up as this like unbeatable thing. When really, if you want to be using this and you want to win, you need to be putting a lot more thought into it. I I I just don't want want to ever see this. Certainly not in constructed. I I don't want the um. Uh, I don't want to deal with the upkeep, and it it feels like you're you're more likely to just splash yourself in the face if you try doing it. It's just I don't like drawback designs. I'll I'll mm. be honest. That's that's what it comes down to. This this has almost no toughness. It does not. The upside is not enough to make up for the drawback. I don't even see the big appeal. Of the upside, if I'm going to be honest. Like when I when I've run these, it's been in a Gimlet deck. Okay. Um, and it works. It's it's not going to take down tur any tournament anytime soon. But it's it's a it's fun to run. Like that's a deck that I have fun running. So yeah. for just you know more casual events, I'll just well, be like, well, I mean, oh, I, I could I could buy the Mart. Um, I'm sorry, this is Martina. The I, I could buy that Margarita Glass could could pop up in casuals, but. I don't really see the. It's too, it's too pricey. You, you don't do. The, you don't run this in casuals. Right. Really. So it's it's like it's for rich casuals. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm I gonna mean, pass on this one. I'm I'm not happy to see it here. All right. That's fair. Next up. Next up at three thirty milliliters, we have the Pilsner glass. Hmm. Now this I like. Yeah, this this is um I would I would call this the When I first the... started out, I okay. had a lot of trouble understanding this. Yeah? Yeah. Hmm. It took me but well it was like I guess I should say when I saw other people using it, I didn't understand it and so I was sort of afraid to try it. And then like one night I just tried it and I'm like, "Oh, Oh, it's it's the sort of it's the sort of glass that's not obvious as printed. That's true. The first time you use it, yeah. You're like, ah, I mean, you might yeah. think it's like you just you give it a once over, and it's like it looks kind of weird. You're like, wait, why don't I just you know, why don't I just go back? Why don't I common? run this over pint glass? Right, but like you you begin to appreciate the the build around nature to right. this. Um, the the narrower base allows you to keep a smaller grip. And that's important sometimes because you know a lot of players they get their grip gets too big, and that leads to to trouble. The yeah, narrower and... grip, pretty simple, um, typically paired with uh, very very light beers. Yes, um, you know it's it's the the na the fact that its name is Pilsner. Right. No I mean that that should be that should be kind of get the giveaway. I, I mean I think it's a bit spot on. <laughs> you know, like, it, be, it, it was get creative, designed, you guys. Come it's on. like put your pilsner in. Uh, you okay, know, okay, really I guess. Designing that as this, but like, I mean, really, I, I don't really mind that. I don't mind that from a build around. It is leading, yeah. leading the player in a good direction. There you go, and uh, it's got plenty of capacity and um, a decent amount of toughness. It's like a surprising amount of toughness. Yeah, it's it's slightly it's, higher up. It's cost. definitely tougher than it looks. Again, mm. if you just look at it, you're going to completely misevaluate. Right. It. So I guess <laughs> All right, all right. So if the first most important thing was to just read the vessel and not pay attention to people, the second most important thing is to try using it once. Like right. there's not there's not a terribly high um 
there's not a terribly high cost to like running it in limited ones, seeing how it goes. You know, there are plenty of events to do. If it if it goes if it goes south, don't worry about it. And you, you, if there's a more experienced player there, they are you know because everyone went through this epiphany mm, aha mm-hmm. moment. It's just great shared experience. And so if you're new and you're like, could could you, you know, I'm gonna try a Pilsner for the first like every expert in the room there, I will just light up and be like, yes, pick me. Mm. I want to be I want to be sitting right next to you as you figure this out. <laughs> All right. All right, who's up next? Next up at 110 milliliters uh, is the sampler. They they found room to fit in sampler. Yeah. I'm, um, I'm kind of as- astonished to see this. So this is uh, another in limited build around uncommon mm-hmm. uh, where the thing you're building is more samplers. It is. Um, I like mean, this, sam- this... samplers, the, it, samplers have a genius capacity to uh, augment other samplers. Right. right? It's so like there's this sampler... game's slivers, there's this game's strangers, you have right. the sampler. One sampler might as well not even show up. Oh, absolutely not. You like can't, two... it's like, it's it's just, it's impossible to get one sampler, come on. Right. Um, right, and a, and a lot of a lot of ways of, you know, it's, it's listed as an uncommon, but a lot of ways of getting samplers produce multiple samplers. Oh yeah, is is so, the I thing mean, to keep in mind. This is as close as they'll come to to printing tokens, I think. Right. So you don't. Uh, we, we currently don't get any uh, formally printed tokens. Um, right. You have to make do with what you have. Typically, it's a solo cup or something. You just have like lying around. Um, yeah. I've seen uh, paper cones. Oh, as yeah. People use as pogs. That that you, kind of stuff like, happens. And like I've I've been to places where you can just get one sampler and that's usually at like a very places that will have a lot of well I that, guess, a... that's that's a um that's a special limited event right right yeah right. that's that's not a that's not a standard limit but format. at your typical event like if you're if you're playing something that gets you samplers like i want to say four is actually the smallest number i've seen Mm. Like I haven't even seen three. I think I'm, I've I'm pretty three. sure I've seen three, but it's like four is way, exists. way more frequent, and six is uh, yeah between it's pretty four common and too. But yeah, decent design, not really my thing in constructed, uh, if I'm being perfectly honest. But um, solid choice for limited. It's yeah. like, I mean, the, the synergy crops up in all the games we play, right? So. Yeah. This is not itself, it's not really aggro, it's not really mid-range, it's synergy. So you get enough of these, and the the overall effect is greater than the sum of the parts. Right, it's like, you win because I you you just put nine samplers on the table, mm. and it's like, <laughs> you can do anything. <laughs> Nothing is impossible. Nine, right? God. Your opponent let I don't want to, I don't want to face down someone who, who got nine of these. I saw it happen. <laughs> oh my god! Once and everyone, everyone just sort of started watching them. Like, oh jeez. All right. Sampler. Moving on. Uh, next up at four twenty-five. So getting getting a bit more capacity again is the uh, the schooner. Schooner. Well, la di da. Yeah. I don't I don't really understand this one in the in the set in the capacity of the set. Um, it's like I don't. What do we? What do I we have? I'm not designing this. Yeah. I really don't. It's sort of. It's okay. So, we're we're gonna see one later. Uh, the Vison that's has has some of the same uh same same text. Um, and that's like clearly better for its size. And then this also has like the the other text from, um, either Goblet or Chalice. Yeah, I think from it was before. Goblet. I think it was Goblet. Uh, so, you know, this is another thing that hints to me that maybe Goblet Tribal is real, but I don't think this is well, you, you necessarily something that you're going to include. Like, pop it off with a schooner. Pop it with a schooner. <laughs> I think that's fake. Look at you no. funny and play three more champagne flutes. Right. Oh, jeez. Right, and like, for most of the time, you would probably want champla- champagne flute more than this. I'm being perfectly honest. But yeah, um... 
so it's it's got it's got some of the properties of these other things, but really it doesn't fit in either of the roles that those other vessels are doing, either as good or better. It doesn't. I don't know. I, I don't see this one coming together. Right. Gonna be honest. There there are some some corner cases where like you slap your forehead and you say, "I wish I had a schooner right now." Yeah. But like. Also, sometimes like you walk outside and you get hit by a weather balloon. So if you're doing promotions for a particular brown ale, they make you put it in this, but that's that's about the only time I I could see that. Blood Fashion asks, you know, is if... it okay with Dark and Stormy? I, when I play that, it's usually in a box. Mmm. Okay. You know, I did have another thought about uh, about Schooner here. Okay. Um, what did, uh, shoot, I forget what this is called. Crud. You know, there's like, um, you could do, you could do a tutorial game. That's what it is. This, this is you know. really good for helping people learn. Yeah. It is, is, and maybe maybe that's what it's here for. I think like so. So you put like, right, right, right. You, it's, it's an uncommon, so it looks look kind of weird, and you you just put yeah. milk in it, you know. Yeah, wholesome milk. Just like milk, some orange juice in there, maybe, um, or just plain old water, you know, just to just for starters, and that uh, that introduces a lot of the the concepts of the game in a safe environment. So as a teaching tool, I kind of understand it, but. I'm not super happy with that as a design because I think once you're into formal sets, you don't need to print teaching tools anymore. Like right. you should respect your players enough to know that you don't need to print bad things just to tell them to get away right. from it. I don't, um, I don't think I've picked this any earlier than like third to last. Oh my god, I don't even. I th <laughs> and that's just because like. I think if I'm in like such a bad team, situation that I have to plan. use this, that I'm just, yeah. I'm going to concede. I mean, I don't run it, but it's just like, okay. <laughs> well, yeah. I could potentially get into that weird corner case where this is good, and then the other two vessels I don't are even, like, no, no. I don't even see this as a sidebar. Uh, I like, one out of like every ten events, I will want one of these in my sidebar. So like, this okay. is a this is a one tenth sidebar. <laughs> one tenth of a vessel. sidebar vessel. No, yeah. we're moving on. Moving on. Goodbye, at Schooner. Forty milliliters. We have the Snifter. Okay. Now the Snifter. Hmm. Snifter, you can get things done in a day. Um. When I feel fancy and I'm like, you know, I'm gonna bring barley wine to this event. Hmm. You like um. Snifter. Yeah, decent illustration, although I do I I'm sad that I have a watermark on this one. I didn't really mean that. But again, uh, again, yeah. these are these are early spoilers, you know, we take what we can get. Whoever spoils it always puts the watermark on. Yeah. You know. Um like some people like swear by the by the snifter. And I think, you know, they try to put just anything in it and I'm like what are no. you doing? <laughs> You can't. Like, okay, so you have the people who swear by the swear by the snifter and have no idea what they're doing. Right. Put anything in it, and then the people who swear by the snifter and only put one thing in it ever, and you watch the fuck out for them. Yeah. No, they they know what they're doing. So they there's a there's exactly a high there is up. a very high ceiling to um you can to this yeah, play style. There's there's definitely a very low skill floor and a very high skill cap mm. mm -hmm. with the snifter. It is. It's a yeah, skill testing vessel. It is. It's a very. It's a very skill testing vessel. Um, basically, you want. I'm gonna. I'm gonna spoil the the strategy a little bit. If if that's okay. Yeah. yeah. Um, the big idea is that you, the human hand has warmth that it radiates, and it is nice to hold a warm thing, and this allows you to to hold more warmth closer to you. Yes. If you put something cold in this, so help you. you you've, <laughs> you're going like, to be miserable. You're an idiot, and you should feel like an idiot because you did you did the like the stem thing. is like I don't know if the if the illustration that we have is sufficient to to let you appreciate this, but the stem is not holdable. Like I I, I went on about how the the pilsner has a grip that's like okay you you know, 
suffices for smaller grips. This is a baby grip. Like, you cannot do that. <laughs> you're going you're gonna to try that, and you're going to hurt yourself. You need to grasp the entire bulb with your hand and keep it warm. And so it's it's a control all-star. Oh, yeah. Like, if I if I get a couple of these early on at a limited event, it's like, okay, I'm playing control tonight. Mm-hmm. Because yeah, like, like there there's go. always there's always the if guy that you have to I look out win. with and yeah. It's the archetypical control finisher. Yeah. Like literally only gets better as the game goes on. Okay. Well the next one is uh one that I hadn't really expected or heard of. Ah, next up at two hundred milliliters. We have I don't even know if I'm gonna pronounce it correctly. <laughs> um the stange. Yeah, it's Doctor Stange. Yeah, this is uh, this is based on a Germanic root, mm. so it's Stange or Stange. I don't actually. I'm the I'm the wrong person to ask. We would probably I'm have to reach out to, to Space even Cop. even longer to ask. Yeah, well, because I'm a lot. I'm, I'm sure Space Cop would know. Uh, so um, like I've the Stange. Stange. Now, it, it, I've, yeah. I'm told that the root like, for like this. for this comes from uh, like rod or pipe mm. so it's just a, supposed to be as like minimal as possible and i get you... that that's that's it's a very elegant design it's not stackable like the pint uh mm, it's got it's... probably the lowest upkeep of any of the vessels that we've talked about tonight so, so is that just the strategy just you've got like I, I guess I'm looking at it, and it's it's like I cannot think of any strategy I've gone in on where this would even vaguely help. Maybe I'm just not thinking about this vessel correctly. Well, it's, we we can we can come back to it later. I think that um, getting getting a different look at uh, another pipe will allow you to appreciate the elegance. Okay, that this like may, maybe it's just I don't understand the pipe strategy it's okay it's okay well we'll come back to it we we might not actually come back to it. i i kind of like i've i don't know that i would ever use this but i like that it's here it is nice yeah i have i have nothing against it but if you handed one to me i i wouldn't know if i had it upside down or not mm. all right well uh, next up finishing out our uncommons Ooh, last uncommon 215 milliliters we have the stemless one <laughs> i'm so happy about this one this is this is my pick this is favorite in the set uh, favorite vessel like, of the set you know it's I'm, so good and every time i pick it uh, i move i'm i'm happy to have the big grip you know like it's uh it's it's like it's like wine glass but higher toughness I just, mm, I can't get enough. Like again, it's it's similar to the, uh, it's similar to the snifter, in that you really well, you, you, you gotta have something things. like lukewarm, to cool to warm, that kind of thing. Because uh, again, your your hand is going to light on fire whatever contents you put within. Um, but, oh yeah, no no no, snifters can turn into stemless wine glasses that's sort of a fail state of them you don't actually want to use one that's that that's no good <laughs> if that happens jags. to you that's that's really bad but the you know, this this can yeah that i want to talk about like drawback designs Yeesh. but nah i i love it i i want orb to be real like this I is as, like orb a lot i think that I this is as close as we can get to spherical. orb can we? Is orb actually impossible? <laughs> it is. You can't. Uh, you cannot have orb. But this is this is as close as is practical. Like if you get to orb, print... if you get to orb, then the upkeep cost goes through the roof, and that's just right. nah. And then like the the other half of that is like, if I can't get orb, then I want something that they're never ever gonna print again because it's just like new players just will never understand it. Mm. But but back in the day when when I could drink out of bowl, um, and that was that was like oh man, healthy on days. You still get that at 
at legacy events sometimes. Yeah. You get you yeah, get you'll you see that. I mean, you'll oh jeez, you'll you'll see all kinds. You'll see Stein. Um. You'll see. What was the other one? Shoot, no, I think that's just a different kind of Stein, like a you'll a see pewter. All kind of, like, absolute nonsense yeah. gimmick garbage. Oh man, but, every like, everything comes out of the woodwork, including wood. Yeah. But I don't. I don't think they're going back to that. Anyway, no, this no. favorite uncommon. I'm, I'm, no, I'm a big fan. I, I respect it. I just this is the when like, I'm not. I always lose with it. I always like when I'm not start, running pint and constructed. Wrong decisions. When I'm not running pint and constructed, I'm running this. Mm. That's yeah, because they're they're definitely good in different environments. So it's good to sort of have both of them in your belt. Because. Mm-hmm. Because it's just you—you you just sort of get a read on the room, and you're like, okay, you know, one of the others is yeah. probably going to get me there. It's surprisingly easy to tutor for. Mm. That's—I'll I'll say that about it. Yeah, it's—it's it's not as I guess. It, it, it the the lack of stem can be pretty intimidating. It's true for new players, um, but just you know. Get an expert. Yeah, I mean, I've I've gotten over that by this point. So, all right. So onto the rares. <laughs> the rares. The okay. rares have a, are in general going to be a lot bigger. Who <sighs> boy. A lot. Some of them are going to be a lot more difficult. Yeah, sorry, to uh, sorry about the altar on this one. Um, I couldn't get a. It's just a raw picture. Yeah. So this is the uh, the bottle sized wine glass, seven hundred fifty milliliters. <laughs> even the Get your name, whole goddamn bottle. Even in the name oh. is preposterous, you, right? You just go <laughs> all in, <laughs> royal straight. Oh, uh, like I think <laughs> they should have put this in an unset. There's, there's no way. <laughs> it's so like they just wanted to make the biggest thing. Right. Be like, that, okay. You know, look. For, for Timmy, right? Timmy wants to just be like, I'm gonna put a whole bottle of wine in one glass. <laughs> and it's like, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. Yes, I do. It's like fine. Right. I mean, I have, this. I have, I have actually seen these before. Like, it's it's rare, but it's not like that rare that you'll never see. It's just. <laughs> oh Lord. Right, but but it's like like people like people. Like, this is really popular among casual players who only ever play, like, multiplayer hug box loadouts. Mm. They're not even trying to win the game. Just make it keep going. Ah, uh, okay. So this is, this is the, also, I the other... I apologize for using that previous term that I just did. It's fine. Uh, it's, this is the other vessel that I was talking about. This is the only one that's better for, for gold fishing. Because you could fit an entire goldfish in it. Yes. And it can swim around and live in this. That's the, you're going to give ASPCA on you. Right? Yeah. <laughs> like, in a flash. All right. Oh, Lord. But let's go to something that's uh, kind of a... still, still on the big well, side. Something that's less of a joke, I hope. But Yeah, something that's big but, like, actually works. Coming in at 725 milliliters mm. is your decanter. Okay, so this is like the the more serious version of what we just saw there. Wait, well, importantly I mean, with the decanter is that you never just play naked decanter. Right. You're not. Decanter this is, is this is a piece. piece. This is a piece. Right. You don't you don't drink straight from this. That's madness. Right. Like like I. If you if you're drinking straight from this, it's because you're one turn away from losing, and you're just trying to do something silly before. <laughs> Before your opponent takes the game. <laughs> if you're trying to win with this, you've already set up several other vessels. Right. And like, play the decanter, and then on the next turn, you're like, all right, I'm decanting. Decanting, can you stop me? Right, you I'm never... No, okay. You can't, I win. Probably, um, the, usually you have some other, uh, like, accessories with this, and you yeah. never have more than one. Like no. you don't like, even run you more than one, one decanter in your whole as in the your whole set. Piece of your decanter plan, and basically the rest of your plan is like support this decanter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Make this decanter. Now for me, it's this is not really to my possible. taste because the the upkeep on this is absolutely atrocious. Oh, like you, 
ridiculous. It it's essentially requires you to run an extra like 25% of your plan just to maintain this damn thing. Right. Which means that like if someone's on a decanter plan and you can get rid of their decanter, they're just a really awful version of a regular plan. Yeah. So again, this is a this is a design I appreciate, but not really one that I ever want to run. Right, and and it's unfortunately basically impossible to assemble any kind of half decent decanter plan in limited, because just so many things have to go right. I think that's um, I, I think you can pull it off in two HG. In certain places. Yes. If if you if you've got a two HG. Again, you know, 2HG is a slower format. You can go bigger, you can do weirder stuff, and it will just work. And, uh... But it's... Yeah. it's it, There's a combo piece. Which is why it looks so weird. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's not... You're not, you're not seeing the own. entire plan. So that's that's probably why it seems so weird. Right. All right, who's next? Next up at a even f an even 500 milliliters, we have the graduated cylinder. Well, okay, I understand why this one's at rare. Yes. Graduated cylinder. I didn't oh, think yeah. this was actually um, safe. You know, like there's... Um, I mean, they printed like not it. Supposed to... I know, but... Jeez. It's it's mostly for th this is like if decanter is this like the more serious like build around combo vessel this is the this is the like haha -ha, wink wink nudge nudge this is the, the it is but it's also vessel. open ended like I don't, <laughs> I don't really I don't see where the where the other pieces are for this it's. I don't know. Yeah. It's like whenever I like someone, someone is playing it. Like everyone has a good laugh, and like sometimes they win, but usually not. I would, but it, it's 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 sort of it's sort of a. I would be terrified. It's a joke. I would be terrified to see this, because <laughs> you know, like whoever is willing to to, like throw down on a, like niche gimmick joke kind of thing like this. They know something. I mean, or if I've they don't, then they're times. going to ruin the game for everybody. So, I've done it a few times. But I, it's just like, oh, that's that's I open, crazy. I, I get my first set of choices, and it's like, all of these look boring. I just want to be stupid. okay. No, I could I could tell you. Um, I I could I could respect going for the exciting option over yeah. the the sensible one. So that's, and I mean, at the very least, you're going to be able to measure whatever you put in it. Yeah. So there are like it has features. Play, like the the joke the joke is a mechanical one. Is that it's like ah oh, it's graduated. You can be very precise, and the punchline is to what end? <laughs> That's just it, isn't it? It's <laughs> like congratulations. Well, I mean, there there could be no 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 no. As soon as they print the precision matters set, then. You know, we'll see. We'll see oh, this sure. at rare like, again, as as and it'll as make as total sense. Mechanical support for this. Yeah. Suddenly, like everyone who's been buying up hundreds of these. <laughs> oh my God, they're gonna rake it in. I don't think that's gonna happen. Let's let's keep going. Next up at six hundred milliliters. 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 <laughs> You're kind of <laughs> deep in that. the horseshoes yourself, I think. I've had I've had plenty of water in my tank. Oh, I, I I'm very dehydrated. Uh, oh, next dear. up is the hurricane glass. A hurricane glass. Hmm. Sounds like it just sounds powerful, right? Right. You I like. I mean, like, Yo, some some people say that they're they're running out. They, you see, you hear all kinds of like crazy vessel names, but this makes this leads me to believe that the well has not run dry of excellent names. Yes. Definitely, you know, props to creative for this one. Mm. Um, it is a bit limited in terms of what you can do with it. What, what, oh, yeah, super good in casuals. Yeah. Oh, oh, excellent. Good in in casual play. Um, it's it's very much a, a feature of 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 a of a local meta game that developed. Um, 
in a certain part of the United Ooh, States. One, one thing I, I have to interrupt you for a sec to address something that came up in the zoo. Uh, no mitten, the Klein bottle spoilers, those are absolutely photoshopped. I'm, oh, I'm sorry. That's complete Photoshop. Yeah. It's, it's a joke. Like every, every spoiler season, someone, someone posts a slightly more convincing fake of that. Yeah. And a bunch of rooms. I mean, you get can. Taken in. It's it's actually a surprisingly easy Photoshop. There's a tutorial that I read about. Anyway, anyway, so go on, go on about Hurricane Glass. Right. So so Hurricane. Right. It's it's like it's a casual all star. Like because and I even when I'm playing casually, I like to see it show up because unlike a lot of other casual favorites, which draw out the game, Hurricane speeds up the game. <laughs> It's like, okay, every, everyone go, 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 and I'm like, yes. Yeah. Oh, it's exciting. It's an exciting casual card. Yeah. And if someone resolves it in limited, it's it, like, it's always exciting. It's exciting when you play it. Sort of a, you suddenly yeah. have Hurricane. And exciting you have when Hurricane. you suddenly, it, 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 uh, have to Hurricane. It has a, a decent, not super high toughness. Um, also, like, middling to high uh, upkeep. So much power. It, it has a lot of power, though. It is an it is a question that is impossible to ignore, and so I think it's just good for the game. Yeah, okay. It's good. So, that this, so this is your exists. this is your pick for like um, limited bomb, like first pick material. I mean, like you know, mo most a lot of rares are are pretty first sure. pickable if they're not absolute jokes. Um, but just looking down the list. Um, I mean, if I'm doing what I want to be doing, which is, like, picking a rare and then picking every champagne flute I see, uh, then yes, absolutely, Hurricane. Mm, okay. Like, I, I, will, I will play infinite champagne flutes, and, like, you had better pray I don't pull this out. And that's all I want. Like, end champagne flutes in one of I these. Think you can, I think you can still go under it with, um, with shot... I mean, you can I mean, go under sure. anything with shot. Um, yeah, with rock that's... glass, even. Mm, probably. It's it's tough. There's a there's a deciding turning point in the mat in the matchup, right. and you can turn it, the corner really... with hurricane, and then you know, then right. the game's it's yours. It's like if I don't slip up and they don't slip up, then it's like I need to get my hurricane before a critical turn, or mm, else they mm -hmm. grind me out a little better than I grind them out. Yep. But they don't. They like the Good, the rock class doesn't have a bomb. That's, on that's the what this hurricane. is. Solid. Yeah. That's the hurricane. Yeah. All right. Next, Next up, up at five hundred fifty. What did you have more about hurricane? Nope. All right. Next up at five hundred fifty milliliters is the Sam Adams. The the Sam Adams glass. For whatever reason, they decided that this one was going to be promo only. Yeah, That's, you so can't it's... get a like a normal. There's no such thing as a normal version of this, and right. this is like the picture of the overtuned vessel. Like Absolutely. there's so much refinement that went into this to no particular purpose. <laughs> I just... Right, it's like you do all of this, and it's like you you've you've played a very fancy. Pint glass. I thing. know. It's just at the end of the day, it's just pint again. I was like, oh no, it's a, it has the bell, Actually, the bowl, a little less capture. capacity than pint. Whoops. Yeah. Not that it's a big enough difference to usually matter. No, but and you know, and they'll go over on pint. the they'll go on about the laser etching at the bottom to nucleate foam and the bell to capture it and the pour spout for for easy control and it's like. Come on, guys! <laughs> it's, like, Wait, and it's got so it's many so abilities, done, right? You can't even like customize it the way like the pint glass is very simple, which makes it a good canvas. But then this is already kind of a design mess. I this know. Is, if honestly, is... if they if they made a non-premium version of this, I might be more enthusiastic about it. If I took if I tore strips off of three different Jackson Pollock paintings chewed them up in my mouth and spit them out, this is what it would look like. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, I don't know what more I can say than that. I did have to... I'm... I did have to get this in, though. Just I the, mean, it's, the, it's the, in the set. The we, it's we in the set. We have to... We have so to that's review. my review. So, moving on.
Next up at 730 milliliters is the Swan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but, uh... So again, like like Decanter, this is not the end of the story, right? This is uh, this is in fact only the beginning. It's a uh, it's a combo piece. Like it's it's in some ways serves a similar combo role to, to a, a vessel that's been out of print for a while, the Horn. Hmm. Yeah. But they they they've had to, they just keep leaning harder into must combo, must combo, must build around. I do. I There's mean. No- I, I appreciate that this is uh, topologically different from all the other oh, designs. Oh yeah! I've seen. So like, like this is this is a good. Um, sometimes I see like kind of jerk players show up and try and prey on newbies with this because the newbie will simply not comprehend. <laughs> Jeez, if I, I think if I see this on the other side of the table, I'm bowing out. <laughs> like, this, something has gone wrong in order for... I, I just go through the little gap in the middle. I'm like, okay, two more mimosas. Like, <laughs> oh, jeez, okay. I'm just like, yeah. boom. You, you have to figure me out before I need to figure you out. It's true. And that, I mean, the illustration is incredible. Oh. This is, it's a like, home they run. They definitely had one of their, their best artists on the case. Oh, for Primo. This one. Mm-hmm. Like, I, I respect it, maybe mostly for that, in that, like, I, like, the one I have, I'm not even, I will never play it, but I want to keep it in my collection, because it's like, ah, oh, check out my swan. The swan. It's, it's sort of a, sort of, sort of a snoot, snootiness point for me, I guess. It's like, if you're a serious player at this shop, you have to have a swan in the collection. No one uses that. You have to have I think you have to have a, a plan in place when you face down the guy who who brings out the swan. You definitely need to have have your footing. If you have your oh, footing yeah. and they play swan, it's like, okay, we can go. No, okay, squirrel token. It's fine. Like, it's fine that sampler only combos with sampler. Like things don't have to be. Yes, okay, this is literally an open-ended combo piece. Yeah. I get it. Which, but that which doesn't do necessarily like. make it like powerful or good or synergistic. Sampler is the the epitome of synergy. I don't really see what this synergizes with exactly. Um, I'm just sort of labeled it as combo because I can't imagine it going into any strategy directly. <laughs> right. It's basically, I've seen people win with this. We're like, this one was actually part of why they won. Holy crap. Um, and it's basically, like, it's it's one of the, it, it was it was not like a, a tournament or like a big event, but it was it was like a mid-size event. And it was just one of the, one of the sort of more creative players is like, I'm going to put together the weirdest list I can that still wins. Wouldn't you know, Swan's involved. But just like um, in Magic, actually. There was a there was a swans combo in magic. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Man. Yeah, okay. No. Okay. I'll I'll give you I'll give yeah. it credit for that. All right. It's always down to swans somehow. That's, That's your swan. Uh, next up. Yep. Three hundred milliliters. Mm-hmm. Uh, the tulip. The tulip. Huh. You know I um, this is probably bad on me. I hadn't uh, looked ahead on this. So I'm I'm kind of I'm blindsided. Mm. Is this? Oh man, no! This is this is Goblet Tribal. Yep. This is this is this is the you, rare. Oh, I should have right? known. You you have you have your goblet, and and you want to top off if you if you have a few goblets in play and you manage to land a tulip. It's, I don't know if I've actually ever won from that, like, against that board position. No, 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 like, okay. Could you, could you read us, just for comparison, like, side-by-side side, Snifter again? All right, so Snifter, uh, at Uncommon, is mm-hmm. uh, 240 milliliters. Uh-huh, 240. Uh, Tulip at Rare is 300. It's 300. See, that's, like... 
I see. I, I don't think it's that weird for this and Snifter to be in the same set for that reason. So Tulip, um, as the as the Goblet Tribal uh, Lord, if you will. Yeah. It sort of fills a a space between um, your your Goblet plan and your Hurricane plan. I really like that. Right, your your Hurricane is way more aggro. Mm. And just like Ogle Blog, I am here to crush you. Your tulip is a little more subtle in the power that it provides. I do like that. Like it's, it's, it's. It would be really easy to like come out with a vessel that's just like, you know, fancy goblet, right. <laughs> you know, or a double goblet, double. and then it would be too obvious. But this, it's still goblet tribal, but it's it's more. Um, more clever than that, I want to say. Right. Yep. No, tulip is a is a very valid. Oh, it's fi- it's fine first pick. Even if you don't want to be goblet tribal, it's it's a great right. first pick. Um, and like the the a big difference is that like later on, um, like I you, like hurricane is much more like because its power is a lot more obvious. Um, it tends to get snapped up more easily, mm. more quickly, no, whereas Tulip that. being a little more subtle, but if you know what you're doing, still about as good. Um, like, def- like definitely, if, if I'd rather play the Hurricane than the Tulip into a completely empty board, mm. if, we, if we get to that point. Right, right. But how often do you get to the late game with a completely empty board? You usually have something going on, and so the tulip is online and doing some work for you. And so that's why I say it's it's about it ends up being about as powerful as the hurricane. Right. I I can't give it any better than that. It's pretty good. All right. Let's okay. see. You know, Winding second down. Second to last. Second to last. This is, this is my milliliters. my favorite rare. The the wizen. Absolutely. So I think I had I had mentioned this before when we were talking about one of the other vessels. Um, <clears throat> this is what that one was trying to be. Right. This one is is stupendously powerful. Mm. Like so, there's a decent amount of toughness. Upkeep cost is large, but not impossible. So uh, mostly owing to the the just massive capacity. Yes. Um, you know, I mean, you'll you'll find a lot of people who swear by by, by Vison. Um, and it's just you know, right now my local meta has shifted mm. to where like really I just want to be carrying a backpack full of champagne flutes every night. I see. Um, but that's that's just you know local meta. Um, no, this and Hurricane would be way too much top end. You you can't do yeah. that. Yeah, you can't do that. Um, but and no, you know, have, you also have... can't just put anything in this. No. Uh, mostly, it, it's sort of the the opposite of the snifter that way, or the inverse. Like for both of them, you can't just put anything in, in them. But like, you want to do more or less whatever you would not put in a snifter, you can you can put in this. Right. As a as a general rule, just a because, baseline. Because your 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 good uh, your good wizens uh, should be. Should be pretty cold. That's exactly a tact look. It's it's way it's more elegant and less wordy than the Sam Adams for basically the same effect at the same rarity. Right, like basically the same effect, same rarity, but a lot easier to just work with. Mm-hmm. Like you don't have so to. No, I'm a I'm a big fan. Bend over backwards for the Wizen. The Wizen is willing to work for you. All right. Okay, and then we, we get to we get to finish off the one. set. And of course, they have to make one of these in every set. Oh boy! Put it on the promotional light. It's like at a at um one thousand four hundred twenty <laughs> milliliters. So that's one liter, and the weed number um, is the yard. The yard. Oh this is, lord! This is okay, casual only. It is. Only. It is absolutely casual um, only. Um. You can you can get these. It's it's a mistake. That okay, unless they completely uh, change the the format uh, and everything's like battle cruiser. 
then. Like, if uh, we change over to battle cruiser drinking, we're like, no one's even playing anything less than a leader. Then, like, sure, run the yard. <laughs> run the Whoa. yard. <laughs> Why not? Like, <laughs> run a whole day marathon. <laughs> oh man, like too slow doesn't even begin. Like it, and and an upkeep cost. It has a a mandatory accessory. Like it right. doesn't even stand up on its own. Right. It's, like, <laughs> Like, I don't even care if my opponent gets an early yard, because what they've just done is sign the What the, you ramp to you ramp up to yard? Sure, let's let's ramp up to the mood while we're at it. Wait, <laughs> meanwhile, I'm doing something for, like, adults. And so I win. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Uh, that's, it's weird that they would put two, like solidly gimmick cards in the same set, but I understand that they, they serve two different I'm glad that they were like, at rare and not filling up my, oh my God. choices at common. You saw those at... Oh, man. That would be a huge, huge blunder if they put this at anything less than rare. I mean, they should invent a, a new rarity to to just keep these completely out of limited. Yeah. I, like... No one, no one wants this to happen. Like, no one okay. wants this to happen. Like, you're not gonna if you if you run this, you're not gonna be buried by shot. You're going to be buried by anything. Right. You're gonna be like, buried by like a like stiff a, breeze. A like, the snifter plan looks like aggro compared to you. <laughs> oh my god. And like normally in like an environment full of people who are thinking before acting. Snifter is the the dirtiest thing on the planet, but then we go off the planet to the moon and find the yard. <laughs> oh man, Nomitten has thrown down the gauntlet. He says, "If you get eight shots before I land yard, you're crazy." Well, no, all right, come, come to where I drink if you want to see people who can throw down shots. Like, <laughs> he swears you can no, my you're... yard all you like. Oh, I, I'm not gonna stop you because you no. Know, we've had some. We've had some great. You want to play it? We've had some. We've had some big hits in the set. <sighs> but so that's I'm, the, I'm yeah, happy that's about it overall. Any so anyone like, that you wanna you wanna go back to and get um, another uh, like closing thoughts about? I guess like again, um, you know, I I, I didn't uh, talk about the the chalice. Um, oh, where do we have uh, Chalice? When, I, when I'm feeling Skinner. not quite as serious and I want to just do something Stain. where it's more about style than grinding out wins. So, you know, a more, you know, a, your, your, your usual casual fight in... Oh, no, no, the, the right. other one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, was that Goblin? That's Chalice. There we go. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, I was looking in the wrong rarity. <laughs> okay. Wait, what was it? I always get Chalice and Goblet mixed up. No, Goblet's the next one. This one's Chalice. Okay. Yeah, okay, it's yeah, hard, It's hard to tell at a glance. It is. Wait. You, it's easier to tell by feel. I, when, mm -hmm. I'm, when I'm at a more casual event, and it's like, do I, do I feel like, you know, going with my more serious plan tonight? And it's like, no, then you'll probably catch me playing Chalices. And I go for like basically it, it's the it's the classic two chalice strategy, and you just you just have two chalices, and everything else that you do is about those two chalices. Yeah, so no bottle in the set. That's that's true. There are there are a lot of like conspicuously missing characters, but I think that we'll that we'll see them in a in a follow up set. Like there. Things come and go, you know. You have to. You, you can't have everything in every set because there's right. just not they, space. They want to keep the format varied. Yeah. All right. Yeah, there's not a ton of support for Chalice in the current set, which is why I, I'm only doing it casually. I see. I see. But I have. But yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna stick to my pints and. Uh, you oh, know, every, and every every now and again, stemless um, stemless wine. You know, just to reiterate. There is, there is no drinker on the planet too good for a pint glass. <laughs> Not a single one. If they say they are, they're, they're a liar, a fool, or both. All right. Well, thanks, everybody, for, for joining me uh, tonight. Thank you also to Medibot, my, my uh, 
co-reviewer yeah. of this set. Thanks for thanks for bringing me on. You know, I love yeah. to uh, you know talk about this. I just I just like the uh, just the way the ways the different designs can go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was good. All right. Well, um, that's uh, that's all we have tonight. That's the set. So uh, mm-hmm. we're gonna we're gonna let you guys go. It's good night, mm-hmm. everybody. Good night.